Hi, I'm Alex. I'm being an apprentice heating engineer today. I'm on site with Steph and we've just took the old boiler out. So normally I am in the office answering calls, but because it's International Women's Day, I am actually on site. So let's go. What's today's job, Steph? So we've took down an old logic combi uh, and we're putting a new one in. <laughs> so what got you into being a heating engineer? Um, I just enjoy being quite... Oh God, no, I can't. I can't do <laughs> this. Hands -on. I can't do this. I can't do this. Right. I just enjoy being really hands-on, to be honest with you. Um, doing all technical jobs. Fixing things. Putting new things in. Was there anything that you thought would have been a lot harder becoming a heating engineer and then actually doing it? I think the strength side of things sometimes obviously I'm not as strong as some people where they can lift a boiler off the wall and put one back on but there's ways around it that you can obviously strip the boiler inside, take it off. So where there's a will there's a way. Yeah definitely, <laughs> definitely. What else can I help you with today Steph? Uh, we can do a bit of pipe bending if you want. Uh, we've got some drilling to do for condense and putting a new condense outside as well. Um, and I'll show you about wiring off and obviously doing flu. Oh, so real? It's do exciting. <laughs> What is it like, would you say, being a woman in this industry? Um, it's difficult, especially when I first started. It was a lot, it was quite difficult, just because obviously, it's people aren't used to women being in this industry. Yeah. Um, so there were a lot of judgmental people out there. But slowly but surely, we are actually getting better and better at accepting. It's still a shock to most customers when I do turn up in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we're getting there, slowly but surely. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Would you give advice to anybody else coming into this industry? Any advice that you could give them? Any women at all? Any advice? I would say stick at it. It will be hard in the beginning. Um, and also get to the gym. <laughs> get your strength up. <laughs> you do need to be quite strong to uh, do this job, but just don't give up. Yeah, that's just keep nice. going. This customer's chose a 35 kilowatt boiler, combi boiler. The reason why they've been recommended a 35 kilowatt is due to the amount of bathrooms that the customer has in the property. So they've got two bathrooms upstairs, an ensuite in a main bathroom, and then they've got a little um, downstairs toilet here. So that is why I each recommended a 35 kilowatt. Go on. Go on. Give it some. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, reaction was well. <laughs> quite hard as well, to be fair. Hey, it's perfect, that. It is. <laughs> is it? That is bang on. Is it? That is brilliant. That was absolutely brilliant, and it was a lot easier than I thought. Yeah. <laughs> if you get the end of the copper, pop it in. You see that bit there where it's coming through? Just make sure this yeah. is on the catch. And this is your guide. Put your guide in. I want you to, don't follow when you do this. <laughs> Put your foot on there. I want you to pull this towards you. That's it. Yeah, there we go. Lovely. Is that enough? Yep, that's enough. Fantastic. And then, yeah, that's it to get it out. Brilliant. Go. That's a kick. Alex, look at you, girl. <laughs> <laughs> look at you, girl. <laughs> Yeah, so I've just done some pipe bending. Um, it's a lot easier than I actually thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be a lot harder, um, but yeah. It's quite um, heavy as well. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> so I just want you to do this top bit here. Yeah. yeah. So, if you try and just point it like that. We don't want to burn the wall. Either, that's it, we? that's right, yeah. It's hard to reckon it's being fastest here. Oh, no, that's all right. There we go. So, how do you think today's gone, Steph? Do you think it's yeah. gone okay? Really well. Do you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. God. Really Would you? Me. Oh, real. Thank you. Would you hire me as your apprentice? 
Yes, I would. Would you? <laughs> I'll be back tomorrow. I <laughs> so now I am going to go back to the office. Now we're finished up here um, and hopefully catch up on everything that I have missed today. Um, and yeah, get back into the swing of things. Uh, you never know, Steph. I could be back being uh, your apprentice next week. <laughs>